The eCodex Standalone Connector The eCodex Standalone Connector offers an independent and secure solution for the digital transmission of sensitive data in judicial cases. This is especially interesting for EU member states and interested countries that do not have their own end application. In these cases, the standalone connector can provide this functionality and serve as an electronic receiver. To use this option, the country needs to install the standalone connector and the Domibus gateway onto a server with an adequate connection to the Internet. It will then be linked to the eCodex system. The receiving country and the competent court have to be available as a recipient on the European e-justice portal in order to be ready to receive digital forms in the context of cross-border cases. Countries that have other ways to send claims, apart from using the EU e-justice portal, can of course use their own dedicated applications. For example, Lyon's IT company has developed specific software for an enterprise in another European country. The customer has not paid the bill and is ignoring all reminders. Luckily, the home country of the defendant is linked to the eCodex solutions by the standalone connector. Leon can now quickly and easily start a European order for payment procedure against the customer online. In order to do so, he logs into the European eJustice portal and looks for the receiving country and their competent court. Leon chooses the right file for a European payment order and fills in the form. If needed, he attaches supporting documents. As soon as he has completed the form, Leon signs it electronically. Now he can send the claim. The claim makes its way via the eJustice portal through the eCodex Domibus gateway and finally arrives at the standalone connector in the receiving country. Here it appears in the form of a PDF and XML file in the register of the responsible court. To work on it, an authorized assistant can move it via drag and drop to a desired folder on their personal computer. After the evaluation of the case, the court sends the relevant papers to the defendant by post. The respondent confesses to the debt and the court declares the European order for payment enforceable. The customer finally pays his bill.